Bonjour my friends, I'm Frankie and welcome to Club Foodie. We all like to start the year off on the right foot and we at Club Foodie are no exception. The first recipe of the year I like to share is a salad like I have in the past with my Julian winter or Asian salads. Here's another one that I'm sure you'll enjoy as much as I do. In today's episode, I'll show you how to make my classic Cobb salad. Made with fresh ingredients, including chicken and bacon, this is such a flavorful salad. Pour on some delicious blue cheese dressing and here you have a delicious meal to enjoy often. So my friends, let's get cooking. We'll place about two to two and a half cups of chopped iceberg lettuce per plate. Using a bench scraper, we'll place a row of hard boiled eggs, but only the yolks that we also chop. Now we'll do the same with bacon. Now, if you want a great trick to cook bacon perfectly without the mess, click on the top right corner of your screen. We'll make another row with cooked chicken breast, but we'll only use half of it, and you'll see why in a few seconds. Followed with cherry tomatoes cut in half. Then we'll add the other half of the chicken breast. Now it makes sense, right? Next, we'll make another row with avocados. To prevent them from browning, we'll toss the cubes with lemon juice, okay? The last row we'll add is our chopped egg whites. And how beautiful is that? Remember that we always eat with our eyes first. All right, so we're not done yet. There's more ingredients to add to it, like some crumbled blue cheese, about one tablespoon per plate, and fresh chopped chives, not a lot, about a teaspoon per plate. And for the finishing touch, we'll sprinkle on some fresh chopped parsley. From here, you can use your favorite dressing. Mine is blue cheese. And my friends, this is her classic Cobb salad. Visually appealing and absolutely delicious, this is a meal you can enjoy anytime. With a variety of fresh ingredients, this salad is not only tasty, but good for you as well. It's a great way to start a new year. I hope you give it a try soon and be sure to visit clubfoodie.com for ingredient amounts and more info. Until next time, my friends. Bon appétit.